welfare of the piglets and not getting crushed. That's the whole purpose of this. Because when you look at some of these, and I've, I've done a bit of work around this and, and looked at some of you know, the pigs in the stalls, it's actually more dangerous for them to be out of them because when they're in them, they're actually protecting the babies. If you put them out of them, they, will, they could roll over on the babies and, and, and the piglets die. I mean, and that's the other side of the story, isn't it? Oh, absolutely, 100%. And uh, the key thing is, is the farm watch that, who released this video in Safe of COVID, of course, are driving this, were so concerned that there was animal welfare uh, at risk. Why did they sit on this video and not tell MPI about this for three months? So what the clear message we need to send is that there is a growing uh, imported pork coming into this country, 60% of pork in this country is coming from countries that do not have the same animal welfare standards as us, that still use sour stalls. And with Gareth Hughes's Origin of Labelling Act coming in, all they simply need to do is add Manuka smoked and it's New Zealand made. And so there is a lot of concern that also with our EU trade agreements there is nothing in there to protect and keep to our standards environment and animal welfare for our imported food products. Okay. Hey Sarah, good stuff. We've been on this regional trip in the last couple of weeks. Um, you're a good country girl. You tell me, wh wh what's your favourite region in New Zealand? If you were to choose one to go to for the weekend this weekend, where would you go? Uh, Central Otago, down, hands down. Most beautiful place in the country. Ah, because you're a Pinot girl as well. Hey, good on you. Thanks so much for coming on the programme. You are fantastic. Um, Rural Exchange, uh, 5 till 7, Saturday and Sundays, of course, with Carter's Tyres. 18 uh, minutes away from 7 after the break. I've given Amanda and Mark a bit of a challenge. Uh, we're summing up the AM show.